Hello everyone, my name is Viper and welcome to a new video on my channel. In this new video I bring you a video about what to mage for the next update in my opinion and what items you guys should focus on if you want to maybe make some commas while we mage or what is the new meta of the new items that people will try to buy and I'll try to to show you why the items are that good uh, or why you should focus on them because i think the demand will be very high some of the stuff that uncama touched in this update are completely insane uh, really really you will shake the market in my opinion it's a good thing it's a good thing that things change i still think most of the items from before will still be pretty strong and uh, you should you should still keep maging uh, this video is more about uh, telling you what's gonna come uh, now that uh, will be worth maging as well including the other items and we start off with one of the most broken, if not the most broken buff that we got so far, which is uh, the uh, sucker set. Uh, I don't know what Ankama was thinking with the, the sucker set, but the bonuses that it gives are completely insane. It basically gives a 10% gives a in ORS, gives 15 damage, 60 power, heals, vitality, everything. It's pretty pretty insane it gives the ap as i said bonuses completely normal and the items don't have a lot of vitality it's the only problem but they are rings so even though they are 100 like 199 below level 200 since they are rings the vitality is not a big as base and in normally in rings the vitality doesn't is not as big so in general if you're gonna equip it with another set it's gonna be good for level 200 if you know what i mean the stats are also good like just the amulet gives two range two summons that's already good for certain classes the only problem is that if you want to use this set on ozamodas it's not gonna work because ozamodas does not profit from uh flat damages like this but all the rest is nice see it doesn't have resistances the stuff but if you as i said if you mix it up, mix it up with another set it's gonna become really 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 strong don't mind my build my build is just an example of uh all like stuff that got buffed like <coughs> sorry the grizzle got buffed the sucker got buffed the volcanic stuff got buffed and yeah for me the uh sucker set is one of the best at the moment if you want to get some commas up next we have the grittle set and the grittle set boys it's got buffed it got buffed i think it's gonna be kind of a melee set maybe it can pl be played the uh, range as well but it will be very very meta uh, basically the set is super super nice in stats uh, the items itself uh, give uh, resistances uh, uh, at the moment not like the sucker set and uh, they give a lot of crit res as well in a game there's a lot of critical uh, damage the vitality is also good in every single item there's 400 vitality here 400 vitality on the belt and on the helmet of course you will need to get an exo for the ring so if people want to get some ap's and mp's uh, under jewel magus you have a ring to exo the Kralov also had two rings and they buffed it in a way that's insane i feel like before the only thing that the set gave was a 40 chance 40 strength and uh, critical rest that's all they gave and now it gives vitality um i, I think it gave ap as well i'm sorry vitality uh, flat damage lock and fire rest so you have so much res uh, you have 15 here, 10 here, 10 hurt here, and fire. So you have basically, you have resistances in everything, um, which is super, super nice. Uh, the vitality is super, super nice as well. I am uh, gonna try to show you guys um, a build that people are messing with, and they are they are super, super cool. As you can see here, the, this build has uh, 1.3k stats. You don't have a lot of res, of course, but it's just an example. Just an example. 1.3k stats, almost 200 flat damage, uh, 12 AP, uh, and you are a melee character. It's super, super good. You guys will enjoy it uh, a lot. Uh, and that's that's why I think the Grittel set will uh, be uh, focused on. Uh, the stats are insane, and it should be good to match. Some stuff are hard to match, though, but you should, guys, should make some commas with it. Up next, we have the Volcanic set. Volcanic set also got buffed by Ankama. Uh, the set was not that bad, but it was not as good as the other int sets. Uh, but now, with the buffs, I feel like it's gonna get better. The stats are still nice on the Volcanic set. 
Uh, and what they did is they gave it even more res and stats. So it's good for pushback resistances. That's for sets where people are interested. And they give it much more res just as a set bonus. So if people equip all three, they have basically 20% res for free. Fire res is a really important. This, this part is really important, even two items. Why I might say? Because uh, fire sets don't have interest. As you can see, it doesn't give interest. And having interest makes it uh, super good for fire sets, ex especially when this set doesn't give fire res at all, and with the fire res you have res to everything. So pay attention to this set as well, everyone. The next set I have in line for uh, you guys, it will be a uh, Nileza. So Nileza, they got buffed as well. As you can see, now the set gives 10% water res, it gives more initiative and it gives uh, more uh, intelligence, if I am not uh, wrong. It is a below level 200 set, but it, if it's something that you want to mage really fast, I think these uh, items must be easy to mage. You guys should get a lot of combos really fast and shouldn't be a pain in the ass at all. We also have uh, a different kind of set that people... Uh, uh, like it went undercover and it's not gonna be used uh it wasn't used a lot and it might be used a bit more i cannot confirm um as i said it will be the rp set the rp set uh, it basically gives uh, everyone 3 ap so if a new guy comes to the game and they don't have exos uh you can legit just use the full rp set and you will be 12 6 uh, with just the full rp set it's set that doesn't give stats uh, only gives ap parry so what people will do will probably, they will use two items in PvP to get some AP parry and MP parry. It also gives the AP, MP and range. But as I said, the other sets I said before, they are much better than this one. Even though this one is also good and still can be matched. So it's up to you guys to see what the demand will be. But this is my opinion on what items can be uh, used uh, to match. Another item um, that we have, another set that we have... Um, that I think will be played as a lot, will be the Submerged set. The Submerged set uh, is one I think maging will be super good because it's a set that is used for agility and uh, it has crits, so people like critting, it has agility crit and it also has AP parry. So AP parry on an agility crit, it's already super nice. Uh, it's three items, level 200. And they got buffed, uh, it gives critical, it gives fire rest, it should be really really nice, it will be used in a lot of sets, because as I said it has three three things that will be used a lot, agility crits, people like it a lot, and AP parry is used a lot in PvP, so people will need it. Other than that, I also have something that people are a bit uh, sleeping on, which is the Door Abyss, uh, uh, the Abyss set. The Abyss set, basically, the items together, for example, uh, just the Ringaling and Dorabis, like the two, two items, or three items, maybe, uh, it's super, super insane. The amount of res this get set gives is completely insane, and uncommon to even make matters into ones, and it, they just added more res. They just added more res, more flat damage, they completely buffed this set, it was not like this before. Uh, but yeah, this set, basically here, it's an inky. Dorabis there, it's an inky. More 20 res, more 20 res. On this set, you can have 50 res. Really, really simple. It's completely insane. I don't know what uh, they were thinking about. I, I can show you a, a Fogger set right here on the screen. As you can see, this Fogger set has 600 sets uh, in uh, in intelligence. Of course, you don't have a lot of sets, but you have 200 flat damage. So for, for Fogger North, for Fogger North, I'm sorry, you can just spam. Uh, Ambush on this set and you have 50 res all. It's pretty pretty cool. I mean, this is just uh, some fun sets that I that I, that people showed me And that I saved so it's just a comparison to see that it's super super nice And as you can see on the screen, there's also another set that I want to show you guys and that set being um, The unspeakable set basically this set is also going to be super used like classes for Sadida, Oza Modus, classes that summon and class that needs a lot of flat damage. Uh, they buffed it to the point where, I don't know why, it gives 12% crit and it also gives 30 base flat uh, damages. It's super, super insane. The flat damages you can get with these sets are out of this world. You can get easily 200 flat damage if you just uh, do a normal set 
with this and you put like ice and spotted if I'm not wrong and the resistances are not that bad as well it gives rest to basically everything fire air earth and another air doesn't give water but you can combine it with a set that gives water it's also has stats to all elements uh, it might be a bit difficult to mage but I don't think so you have some sync in everything uh, the damages are always hard to mage of course but it should be uh, cool for you guys to get commas as well uh, another set that can also be chosen by you guys if you want to uh, to mage it's from the solar zone again it is the burning set the burning set uh, only the boots were really used in terms of uh, pvp at all uh, for the oza mode set for the into the mode set and this time they buffed the set in a way that it gives more res as well and gives fire damage it doesn't give stats but giving more res it's already super nice and the, do the two set bonuses just two items is super nice for classes that uh, will count on the fire damage and heals it also has some ap reduction so for Enripsa, if you want to play ap reduction you can play the burning set i don't think it's going to be as impactful as the other sets but it should be a nice option if you guys want to mage considering this uh, other sets that we have are the um, the past tech set will not be that bad to mage as well another set that i think you guys will enjoy to maybe try to sell or i mean kind of enjoy you can try uh, to sell uh, which will be the bubatron uh, set the bubatron set it got buffed basically now you get more crit and you have rest because the problem with this uh, these items is that they didn't give rest but it can be used now for a crit, uh, crit ag set as uh, again the Kritaji uh, stuff got buffed, so you can try to, to match some Bubatron. Is it gonna work? I don't know. I hope it works for you guys. But I think it might be good. It might be a bit annoying to match this kind of items, but um, it can be used uh, in some sets for fun. It should sell. Uh, I'm trying to do it by order, by the sets that I think will sell the most, and I think the sets that will not sell as much. But these ones so far are the ones I think will be the best. Up uh, next, we have another set which is uh, something that I think will also be used uh, and people will like it a lot, which is the Cycloid set. Cycloid set, it's a multi crit set that just got buffed um, and it's level 200. The, the good part about this set is that it's good with just two, two set bonuses. Uh, as you can see, why, why I think it's going to be used. It's a multi set that gives damage to everything and 12% crit. That's super, super nice. It also gives some stats. And uh, there's a ring to MPX or APX, so if you guys are interested, it doesn't have a lot of vitality, but people will be interested in this, uh, in my opinion. Just the crits, uh, people always like to crit, so in this meta, stuff that uh, sets the crits, people will uh, tend to be interested in it and buying it. Maybe what I'm saying is not correct, but in my brain, uh, it makes sense. I know I have a, a peanut brain, but <laughs> it is what it is. Uh, am I missing something else? I think I tried to round it up. Uh, I can say some other stuff that might get more bought, more bought uh, nowadays. The servitude set got buffed. It gets um, more initiative, more pushback res, and more chance. Um, it's something that got a bit buffed. It's not insane buffs, but a bit buffed as well. Like uh, something that has been already made. The but the got buffed as well. It's the Brucey set. The Brucey set now gives um, it, it gets crit. It's uh, not that bad as well. Uh, another thing that got buffed was the Pandemonium set. It also got buffed. It gives more strength, more heals, and it gives AP parry. Uh, these things they got buffed, but uh, these were already mage. This stuff was already mage. So what I tried to show was stuff that wasn't maged before, and maybe you guys can start maging to make uh, some commas uh, i'm just trying to see if i didn't forget anything else for you guys um, there's also a uh, full misery if you guys are interested but i don't think that's gonna be um, super super insane it was already matched before as i was saying okay there's one more set that i forgot to tell you guys about uh, that i'm on the wrong screen and uh, maybe um, will be used as well which is the sinistrofu set it got buffed as well it got buffed as well it gives uh, a bit more stats so maybe it, it, it can be used in chain sets nowadays you can use it with full grethel and full uh, sinistrofu i think i showed it before the set right uh, this set uh, right here 
You can do full crit build, full sinistro fu. You have good flat damage, insane stats. Uh, it's really, really not that bad with good vitality. Um, but yeah, I think right now I finished it off with all the sets. I hope you guys enjoyed. The theory crafting has been insane. Basically, what I've been doing, uh, it's I've been I did a channel on my Discord. Everyone showed the sets, and uh, everyone is showing me the most. I also asked around if people were to craft sets what sets would they craft and these were the sets people would say they would craft so if they are gonna craft they needed to be mages so i think you guys can make some commas on on this one my top three right now uh, would be uh, definitely um these three uh and uh, the uh, the um, i'm sorry and the unspeakable uh th this would be my my favorite ones would be volcanic sucker and uh Grithil and unspeakable uh as i said this video, it can change. There's two days left on the beta. They can definitely nerf the sucker set because the sucker set is completely insane. Um, it's the only one I think they will nerf. The other one should be fine for you guys to, to match so far on the official servers. Uh, but yeah, it can still change. I can still help you. Don't go around wasting money. This is what I think will be, uh, in my opinion items to match and i hope you guys enjoyed the video i tried to bring something different something to help you guys and not always a uh, pvp it is still related to pvp i'm sorry but it, it is not just a pvp gameplay but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this kind of video don't forget to leave a like it really helps a lot sharing um, and helping the video go further it really helps a lot no joke don't forget to join the discord to see and theory craft with us i always try to uh, help people there and subscribe, of course. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.